gentlemen, boys and girls, cardaholics of all ages, welcome back to Big Al's Cards. Thank you so much for watching. And it's been too long since I've opened a product. And here we have a 2023 Bowman Baseball Mega Box. It's time to get in the Bowman Mega Season. So we got four 10 card packs and two exclusive of the Mojos. Those are going to be five per. As I mentioned in my checklist review video, this is one of the first times that they've done a veteran rookie Chrome Mojo. So I think that does add some variety, but at the same time, we're all really here for the prospect mojos anyway. So let's dig in. My knife was sharp. And let's see what this mega box brings us today. Uh, I enjoy ripping Bowman Megas. I think this year, I'm not gonna do nearly as many as I did last year. I think I did quite a few last year. I know I did a ton the year before, but I think just with the, the watering down of it with the uh, the veterans, I don't know if it's always going to be worth the rip, especially at the price point. Um, but who knows? Get that there. We've got our two mega packs right there. Let's do our four base packs first. So these are going to be just paper and the chromes. So we got Brian Bell, Mark Vientos, Trey Turner, Wilson Contreras, Tatis, uh, first of Justin Crawford, Averson Arteaga, Framie de Leon, Carlos Jorge on the Chrome first, and Max Muncy. All your value is going to be in those two mojo packs. These are, I mean, it's good to get first Chromes. So we hit a Drew Jones, not a bad pickup, but not where your value is at. Max Meyer, Verlander, Trout, Nelson Velasquez, Chris Bryant, Jorge Ruiz, Nikau Huaca Grego, Trey Sweeney, Roman Anthony on the Chrome first, and Kevin Parada. Would love to hit an auto out of these. Parallel would be cool too. Parallel would auto would be even better. Uh, Bobby Witt, Yelich, Shea Langoliers, Matthew Liberator, Cade Cavalli, Drew Gilbert, Jonathan Mejia, Angel Ganau on the first, Colson Montgomery, and Henry Ramos on the Chrome first. And last regular pack before we get into our mojos. DeGrom, Nick Prado, Miggy, Oscar Gonzalez, Vaughn Grissom, Carlos Jorge on the paper, Michelle Deason, Max Wagner, Drew Gilbert, and Moises Ballesteros. So our base packs, of course, are pretty... I don't say inconsequential, but that's not really why you buy these. You buy them for the Bojo packs. So let me get my little pile organized here, and then we'll dig into our Mojos. There we go. Let's do this one first. We'll always do the uh, thickness check to see if we have a hit. Does not look like we have one in this pack. So we got Matthew Liberator. So they did do Rookies too, which it's interesting. Not my favorite way to go about it, but... It is what it is. But Matthew Liberator on the rookie. Ooh, there's a good one. How about a Spencer Jones? That's going to get sleeved. Corbin Carroll on the rookie of the year favorites. There is another great one. Junior Camonero. He's become a really hot prospect. And Randy De Jesus. Probably sleeve those after the video. And our last pack. Let's see if we got ourselves a little something, something. Does not look like we do. Let's see if we can hit a good. Mojo here. We got Fraley Encarnacion, Roman Anthony, Carlos Jorge, Brooks Lee, and hey, Jackson Churio. So honestly, if you can hit some good prospect mojos, you're going to do pretty well despite the price point. I only hit one vet out of that entire stack. One of my mojos was Jackson Churio, even though it's not a first. He's one of the hottest prospects in all of baseball. So I don't think I did too bad with that. I would say probably the best card of this break. It's going to be a tie between one of these two. Glad to have this guy for my PC. He's like the next judge, but like in terms of height. And then this guy's been unbelievable in the minors. So tell you what, let me go ahead and sleeve those two up. I'll sleeve the rest of the first up later, but just so you guys get a card of the break, we are definitely going to give it to these two mojos. Hate to pick two, but we're going to pick two because it's my video. I do what I want. It'd be great if I could get it so that there wasn't so much glare. Well, you get the idea. There's our two best cards of the day. 
So there is a Bowman Mega Box for you. We did not hit an auto or a color. However, I think we made up for it with some pretty solid Mojo prospects. But let me know what you guys think about the, Mo the Bowman Mega Box in the comments below. Thanks so much for watching. Please leave a like, subscribe, stay tuned for more videos. And until next time, bye-bye.